Hi, I'm Skeeter. I'm Scooter. I'm Bam Bam. And today we're talking about our tent. Today we're looking at the limestone six-person tent by Marmon. This is a tent for the whole family. It's best used for car camping and road trips. It easily fits up to five people with loads of room, but we found it a bit tight for six people. It's actually big enough that we moved a queen-size bed in for the kids to play on and had plenty of room on either side for stuffies, blankets, and books. This tent is so big. The Marmot Limestone Six Person Tent is a super easy to put up freestanding three season tent. Um, it comes with guide lines and stakes. It is a dome style tent with poles forming an X over the tent. It's nice that it provides good strength and space. Um, there are two yellow poles with color coded sleeves that make up the main frame and go into the corner grommets located on the tabs. There are clips at various points along the poles to kind of stretch the interior of the tent. And there are two short gray pre-bent brow poles that go around the sides to create extra volume and lots of elbow space. It comes with a seam taped rain fly that has a huge vestibule in front and double zippers um, and easily able to roll up. There is a second vestibule at the back of the tent. Um, the fly comes with two Velcro vents for airflow, and the rain fly has color-coded tabs to make sure that you put it in the front of the tent. This tent is not light. It weighs over 17 pounds. The tent is made up of 68D polyester, and the ceilings and upper walls are both made from mesh that uh, add breathability and light. But this is not a winter tent. It's not made for colder weather. The uh, floor itself is a canopy or bathtub floor, and the whole thing is seam sealed to prevent water leakage. It's super strong, and my kids have been playing in it pretty much every day since the quarantine. The tent has two D-shaped doors. The front one is over 67 inches wide, and there are four zippers on it to make sure that you can get in and out without any kind of traffic jam. There's also a second large uh, door in the rear of the tent. The inside is 77 and a half inches tall, which is definitely tall enough for most people to stand up in. And it's big enough also for me to run around in. And I can't even touch the roof. There are six interior small pockets around the base of the tent. There are two lampshade pockets that will disperse the light when you put your headlamp in them. And there are two mesh pockets on the side. Overall, this is a great value for family trying to get into tenting. It's a nice balance between price and quality. It doesn't feel like it's so cheap that it will break easily when you're using it and not so pricey that you won't want to take it out and use it. It has all the features you want and at a price that's reasonable and an easy package to put up. So would you recommend other families get this tent? Yeah. Okay. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay, would you give it two thumbs up? <laughs>